you. Incredible. <laughs> Am I allowed to get to it? <laughs> oh my god. I love it. I love you. I love you. You look amazing. Thank you. It's beautiful. This is going to be so fun. Victoria, Paul, it is my honor and privilege to officiate the union of your marriage here today. You are each other's puzzle pieces. Victoria, you are that person for Paul. He has always said that you were made for him. Paul, you are that person for Victoria. She's always said, you feel like home. Our person is someone whose locks fit our keys and whose keys fit our locks. When we feel safe enough to open the locks, our truest self steps out and we can be completely and honestly who we are. We can be loved for who we are and not for who we're pretending to be. Victoria, I feel so lucky and proud that I not only found the person that fits me perfectly, but also the person that recognizes this unique and special thing we have built and is willing to take risks and fight for its crazy, crazy beauty. Well, I'll be here for you when things get prickly, like they often do. I find more love in a storm with you than a thousand sunny days without. Our person is someone who shares our deepest longings our sense of direction. Our person is the one who makes life come to life. You're truly one of a kind, and you're beautiful in all the ways. You're from my forever, my best friend, a dream come true, shoulder to lean on. My husband, you're my everything. I love you, that was beautiful. May your love be a lifelong source of excitement, commitment, affection, respect, and devotion to one another. <laughs> and now, by the powers invested in your love for each other, it is my joy to declare you husband and wife. Paul, I don't think I need to tell you what you can do now. We did it! <laughs> <laughs> this is amazing. Like, what an amazing <laughs> This is amazing. Yeah. This is like amazing. It feels so good. What do you think? Do you want to pop some champagne? Yeah. <laughs>